If you want to cast as far as you can, it's important to have the right equipment. Rods like this, 13 feet XSI intensity, do the job perfectly. Loads of power down the bottom to drive that lead way out there into the lake. The reel, of course, is equally important. The line layer on this Aerotechnium MGS is outstanding. It stops the line level dropping, creating friction at the lip and allows you to cast much further. The super slow oscillation on the MGS gives you 50 turns from bottom to top and 50 turns back again. That means the line level barely drops. For maximum distance, line diameter counts for a lot. The thinner the line, the further you're going to cast. But you also have to bear in mind that if you're fishing snags, it's a no-go. Open water and light lines are great and will allow you to reach those far off fish. The perfect line for this situation is Technium. It's really strong, good abrasion resistance and works well with all sorts of fishing. But with such a light line it's essential to use a shock leader. If you don't, you're endangering everyone around you. Suffolk Zippy Shock Leader is perfect for the job. It's soft, supple, doesn't bed in on the reel and casts a long, long way. The tackle we've been using today is more than capable of extreme distance. With a four ounce lead we've been hitting very very close to 200 yards. Having spent over 30 years tournament casting, the tackle available today is just mind blowing. Of course distance casting isn't all about casting as far as you can, it's, it's choice of range that matters. You can fish the margins and mid range quite easily, but casting further requires a good technique. That combined with this rod and reel will get you as far as you ever need.